It's the greatest test of stamina and the ultimate feat of human endurance. It's the marathon. I, I think the plan is to stay as relaxed as possible. You've just got to essentially, I guess, break it down and just go out there and run your own race. Within a realistic time frame, I'll be looking at running sensibly, but also making sure that the second half I'm there fighting and in with a chance. You know, when it gets down to the business end of the race and there's two or three guys all in with a chance, it's not necessarily about the physical talent or the training that you put in. It comes down to the mental attitude and, you know, who wants it the most. It's amazing what you can find in the last um, few hundred metres of a, of a big race, even when you're exhausted. Everybody want to win it. <laughs> <laughs> Elites from across the country and around the globe gather once again for Australia's premier road race. This is the 2007 Gold Coast Airport Marathon. Hello everyone and welcome to the magnificent Gold Coast of Australia which has awoken to a trademark golden dawn for the running of the country's premier long distance event. I'm Jim Callan and thanks for joining us today and with me to bring you all the action of the 2007 Airport Marathon is none other than Steve Monaghetti, our own marathon man. Thanks Jim, great to be here. Where else would you want to be on a day like this? We're bathed in sunshine, conditions near on perfect for this year's race as runners go through their final preparations. And there'd be a few butterflies, no doubt, Monas. Oh, yeah, you just want to get the race going now. You know, you've got a long road ahead of you, so you, you're trying to conserve a bit of energy but make sure you're loose and ready to go when the gun goes. A few of the girls catching up, a oh, bit of a surprise. A little bit chilly as well this morning. The course itself begins in Southport, in the heart of the Gold Coast, then stretches down along Main Beach through Surfers Paradise, Broad Beach and Mermaid Beach to Miami where it hits the first big mark of this great race. Then it's all the way back with the beautiful Pacific Ocean almost lapping at their feet. Runners will then cross the start-finish line on their way north as the course roams through the heart of Labrador before reaching Runaway Bay, where they'll turn for home in the final stretch. Eight or so kilometres to the finish line, some hoping to get there first, many just hoping to get there at all. So that's what faces our brave souls today for the Gold Coast Airport Marathon as they take the starters' orders and they're away in the country's premier road race and monitors. It makes a wonderful sight as they stream through more than 2,600 of them, all knowing the biggest test in running now faces them. Yes, they're, they're, they'll be happy to go. It's a great field, huge field, so they'll try and settle in early.